Hey guys, Alex975 here today. In today's video, I wanted to talk about why I think Soldier Boy won't be showing up in The Boys Season 4, or will make a very small appearance at maybe the last episode or something like that to reveal him for Season 5. But I'll be talking about that more in a few seconds. I just wanted to apologize for not uploading the last two weeks. Uh, I'll talk more about that at the end of the video. So anyways, as I was saying, I don't think uh, Soldier Boy will show up for this season, um, mainly because he's just been imprisoned and the boys doesn't go off traditional like superhero tropes so he won't show up instantaneously once he's been imprisoned and um, i don't even think uh, butcher will be trying to get him out and he's the only person i could see possibly trying the only other way that they could introduce soldier boy back apart from getting butcher to like break him out again is with a uh, homelander uh, trying to reconcile with his father or another way is someone trying to experiment on Soldier Boy to try find a way to stop um, superheroes being superheroes um, by like taking their powers because uh, Soldier Boy's new power can do that. So they're the three main possibilities and I think that's kind of obvious to everyone that they're the three main possibilities. My opinion is it will probably be, now that I'm thinking about it, probably be the homelander trying to reconcile with his father uh, because a lot of people like uh, homelander and his more serious moments so that's a really good entry into that and um, i think the most unlikely is butcher even though before making this video that's what i was suspecting saying out loud and um, it doesn't really make sense because butcher knows that soldier boy probably hates him now for betraying him at the end and Butcher probably doesn't want to risk it and he feels like Soldier Boy is the exact same as Homelander, arguably more dangerous. So yeah, I don't think Butcher uh, will try to break Soldier Boy out, but it's definitely a possibility. And um, I think the experimental, like someone trying to experiment on him uh, is a possibility and it could go horribly wrong and Soldier Boy breaks out. I would say that is a 40% chance of happening um maybe 30 percent something like that and then around a 50 percent chance that's homelander that's my opinion and um, but yeah the reason that soldier boy won't be showing up is because he can't show up because it wouldn't make sense and um, the boys isn't a simple superhero trope and it won't just bring him back because everyone likes soldier boy because soldier boy didn't actually have a like i know he did actually have a major role in the boy season three but he didn't actually have a lot of screen time when you actually think about it and i think a lot of people were frustrated about that because jensen ackles did a really good job on soldier boy but because he's such a small character at the moment uh bringing him back would obviously just be serving to the fans which personally i think is a bad idea and i think they should just keep soldier boy locked up for season four because it makes sense and at the earliest time we could see him back is season five and um, depending on how many seasons they're planning for the boys because if they're planning on only five seasons then they've definitely got to bring them back for season five i think it's confirmed like not confirmed but um it's pretty much a given that soldier boy's got to show up again because he didn't die that's for one so that's like Chekhov's gun kind of thing um but also everyone loved jensen ackles as soldier boy so i think people will be demanding it and even though i just said a few seconds ago that you shouldn't be listening to the fans really like doing whatever they want you to do and um, there's a certain point to that and um, like don't rewrite your story because of them but i think they have to be setting it up for soldier boy to return you can't just say you got locked up and that's when if Homelander dies, uh, Soldier Boy is just still locked up. That just feels kind of anticlimactic. Um, but yeah, that's kind of my opinion. Also, The Boy Season 4 has a lot of things already set up. Black Noir uh, was clearly shown in the trailer. And uh, people might be questioning how he's back. And obviously, I'm one of them. Um, and I've heard a lot of people say from... Uh, uh, I forget what the show is called now. Um, Gen V, yeah. Uh, Sam from Gen V. Yeah, he is Black Noir. And I think that... Is a good enough theory but i think that's also got some holes in it already for example one at the end of gen v they had an announcement trailer of like uh, sam and the other girl and uh, those two like in a new squad and like sam was there so it'd be a bit weird to have him in two groups and one of them is masked and all that also i don't think sam could keep his mouth shut and um, so i think that'd be weird but also it just I don't know what I don't think Black Noir is obviously um, the same guy, even though I really wanted to be because he was so good in season three. But I don't really have a good prediction. But I think the Sam one has kind of already been shut down, and um, at least in my head, I haven't actually watched. I don't remember. I don't know if it was like film theory that made a video on it, but whatever channel I saw made that theory. And um, I probably will go back and watch the whole thing to see why the reasons for Sam is and why maybe they have arguments for why I think he can't be it. Um, and yeah basically 
Black Noir, and then there's Queen Maeve is back, who she kind of left at the end, but there's a billion ways you could bring her back, so there's no real excuse for that. My main thing is I'd say Homelander just found her and forced her with threats or probably killed her girlfriend or something, and I don't know, he must have some bargaining chip as to why she has to come back. Um, something like that, or maybe Homelander kidnaps his, her girlfriend and then she has to come back. So yeah, there's a billion ways Queen Maeve come, can come back, so I'm not really like have any theories for that because there's so many that could be right. Um, but for Black Noir, there is only a very few, and I thought the theory of Sam was good until you look a bit deeper into it. Um, but yeah, that's back to what I was saying about Soldier Boy. I think it's, in my head, it's pretty much confirmed that Soldier Boy won't be in it. I was finding it hard to accept before the Boy Season 4 trailer came out, and even during it, that Soldier Boy isn't going to be in it. And it's kind of looking like it. Obviously, they wouldn't reveal Soldier Boy in the trailer, but I was kind of having that little thing in my head where maybe they have some way of revealing him in the trailer, but I just can't see him coming back. And um, the soonest we could see him is midway through season four but even that would feel anticlimactic and um, and my suspected time will be either in the end credits of see it basically depends on how many seasons of the boys overall is going to come out uh, if there's five seasons i'd say he's definitely going to come at around the end credits of season four or something like that and um, or he'll come around at uh, the end credits of season five if there's a season six and um, but i'd say we'll see him either in season five uh, realistically now seeing him properly not just seeing a clip of him and um, i would say season five or season six no longer than that i don't know how many seasons they plan for the boys but i can't see him not showing up either for the final season or the second final season because he feels like a be all or end all like soldier boy i don't know how like home like it'd be a big fight between him and homelander so i can't see like them uh, if soldier boy failing and they go to the next thing because he didn't really fail uh, he was just kind of betrayed so yeah that's pretty much it for today's video and um, as i was saying at the start of the video why i didn't upload for the last two weeks and um, yeah i've been really busy with school and um, i'm probably going to be busy this week actually definitely i know for a fact so i can only confirm that there'll be one video and that's this video coming out this week i'm hoping one more this week for this channel as for alex m975 there's one coming out today and one coming out the day i upload my next video on this channel but I'm hoping to upload more on Alex M975 because I want to work more on Alex M975 channel because I want to work that channel up to get build it up to um, a high level. And I also, um, Fortnite has got a lot of things going on about it. And although it's about all games, um, I want to focus on basically the most popular type of thing. And I'm really interested in talking about Fortnite at the moment. So I'm probably going to talk a lot about Fortnite for the next week or two and probably then when it slowly dies down and move on to, you know, a new topic, probably just all games again until there's a new big game and um, controversy or big game like to talk about. But it has to be one that I have and enjoy. So, yeah, that's it's kind of a very narrow audience. I kind of there was nothing going on with the gaming world like a month ago. And then I started, I started uploading gaming commentary onto the channel, and then loads of things started coming out. There's also stuff I want to talk about on this channel. The next video on this channel I can confirm is going to be about Godzilla and Kong, the trailer. Just basically a trailer breakdown, because it's obviously, I'm not as interested about that as The Boys Season 4. If this video does really well, I'll probably upload about The Boys Season 4 again straight away. But most likely it's going to be Godzilla and Kong, the trailer that came out. Uh, there's a lot of stuff that came out and I was really frustrated because nothing was going on and then when I kind of couldn't upload on this channel loads of ideas were coming out for the channels like for both channels I was starting to run out of a few ideas and I had to go back to the drawing board and then loads of stuff just started coming out and it was really frustrating and yeah um, that's a bit annoying um, but I do want to work on these channels and I'm hoping that the um, I forget what you call it a burnout which I burnout is kind of going on both channels even though i haven't had the time as well uh, even when i have spare time i just can't bring myself to upload on youtube at sometimes and then other times i really badly want to upload so uh, yeah that's why i want to i want to not do that because i'm really enjoying making these commentary videos and um, it's the editing that's really the main problem not talking like i love talking about the videos but then you have to edit it and it takes a long time um, not too long for me obviously because i don't edit very heavy on this channel but it still takes a decent amount of time so yeah that's pretty much it for today's video i'll see you guys in the next one bye